viewers how are you doing today today is my first session on mental maths and i just wanted to demystify it in the beginning that is what is mental maths mental maths is when you do a maths question in your brain without using a calculator and without using a paper pencil and the most important thing is that practice is the key do not be overwhelmed do not be confused just practice and you will improve definitely today is the first class and um, we will be doing in the beginning that how do we add one digit numbers that is numbers that have only one digit in them and how do we add them together so for example we have the number 2 and we have to add a 3 to it so in the beginning when the children are introduced to mathematics and addition they just make these circles or they are given these objects and then they just add those objects or circles together just like this and we arrive at 5 as the answer and as we grow older what happens is that we see the number 2 and then we have these imaginary circles in our brain that sum up to 3 and we just add them together that is 2 and then 3 4 5 so we have these imaginary circles in our brain and we have to improve this step further in fact we have to learn that 2 plus 3 is 5 as soon as you start learning these basic addition facts that is 2 plus 3 is 5 you will improve in your mental maths by leaps and bounds so for example 3 plus 4 is equal to 7 don't think about it you just have to arrive at the answer there and then 6 plus 3 is 9 don't think just learn this thing when you skip the step of actually adding in your brain and you learn these addition facts these single digit addition facts you will improve in your mental maths and the next step is that you need to learn how the number 10 is made which combination of two numbers make the number 10 for example 5 plus 5 is 10 6 plus 4 is 10 7 plus 3 is 10 1 plus 9 is 10 so just learn these make 10 numbers the, those two numbers that make the number 10 the number bond you can call that so those two numbers that make the number 10 they're not that many so just learn them i will also be giving you the list of all these single digit additions so that you start learning them i will be making worksheets for helping in the learning process and you can also use my metal maths app that is available on google play store and ios app store once you know that which numbers make the number 10 and you know your basic addition facts like 3 plus 4 is 7 we will do the more complicated questions like 7 plus 5 In the beginning what you will be doing is that you add an imaginary 5 in your brain to 7 that is 7 8 9 10 11 12 So now how can we use a mental math trick here So we know that 7 plus 3 is 10 So how about we borrow a 3 from 5 that is we split 5 into 3 plus 2 and we give this 3 to 7 to make it into a 10 this will be then simple addition of 10 plus 2 which is 12 let's do another question 6 plus 5 so what can we borrow from 5 to make 6 into a 10 so 5 can be split into 4 plus 1 and 4 and 6 make 10 so the question will become 10 plus 1 which is equal to 11 isn't this an easier way of doing this addition 
Let's do another question. 8 plus 4. So 8 can be turned into a 10 by give, getting a 2 and we can split 4 into 2 plus 2. So 10 plus 2 is 12. Now the most important thing is that you start practicing. First learn these addition bonds like 3 plus 4 is 7, 5 plus 5 is 10, especially the make 10 techniques that is the two numbers that add up to 10 and then start attempting these um, slightly more advanced questions like 8 plus 4 and 9 plus 3 where the answer is coming out to be more than 10 and you can use my mental maths app you just skip all the questions and you start the plan click on plan and then this is exactly the same things that i taught you in this class number one and you just click on practice and then start attempting these questions and you will be practicing all these things that I've taught you in the class today. So I will be also giving you, making you some worksheets about this topic to help you if you do not want to use the app and you want a paper-based approach in learning this technique. So I will be definitely giving you worksheets. So I hope you like this video and just go and practice because practice again is the key to mastering mental maths and you will start improving in your maths and yes, eat dark chocolate, but it's good for your brain and just practice and you will start seeing improvement from day one. I hope you like this video. Do share with your friends and family and do subscribe to my channel. Thank you and goodbye.